Let the drawing begin. The first number is number 17. Emily, think of all the things we could buy if you win the lottery. It could change our lives. Oh, don't be silly, my little pumpkin. What's a few dollars in your pants pocket really mean? Why, Charlotte, you and I are the happiest couple in the whole world, and I don't have anything in my pants. Yes, dear, I know. <laughs> number 61. And the final number. The number worth $25 million. That number is... Number 52. It, it seems I've won. You won? <laughs> we won. Hey, we won over here. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh Charlotte, oh, get, a, get a grip on yourself, Charlotte. Oh, 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 oh excuse me, lady. <laughs> Sir, I'm sorry to interrupt you, but I believe I've won. Sir, you are absolutely right. You've won the state lottery. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what are you going to do with all that money? Well, well, perhaps first I'll get my bowling ball rebuffed. What about mansions, cars, and quitting your job? Oh, I'm not going to let $25 million go to my head. Listen, you ignoramus. You just won $25 million. You can have anything you want. Well, maybe I'll get a new bowling ball. But rest assured, it won't change me. Won't change me. Mr. Johnson for letting me into your home to interview you. It's all right, not at all. Can you tell me have you changed at all since you won the $25 million? Nah, people don't change. You're the same guy. People think you change, but you don't change. Hey, can I offer you something, huh? No. How about some 10s, some 20s? Go ahead. No, no. There's some 50s in the bottom over here. <laughs> hey, Puckett, come over here. Where are you going to order this dish, huh? Hey, Puckett, come here, baby. What are you tell? Have I changed? No, Snookums, you're still just the same as you always were. Keith, <laughs> yeah, we can take that. Hey, take this piece off. Come on, come on. No, no, no. no, 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 no. Yeah. Are you telling me you haven't changed at all since you won the lottery? Oh, that's right. Ginger and I still enjoy the same simple things we always did, like listening to Frank Sinatra. Oh, do you prefer his albums or tapes? No. Oh, Frank just sits at the foot of the bed and sings his greatest hits, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> well, your wife certainly seems happy. How long have you been married? 20 years. 20 years? You look young. Oh, this ain't my wife. This is Ginger. I got rid of my wife, and she had it coming to her, too, I'll tell you that. <laughs> How did your children react to all of this? Oh, my kids, who knows how they feel? I stuck them in boarding school, you kid, and they had it coming to them, too, I'll tell you that. <laughs> you got rid of your wife and children. Hey, don't pick me like a bad guy, We I was good to my mother. I told her, forget about the 200 she owes me. <laughs> my old man, don't worry about him. I sent him a bottle. He's all right. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> are, you, are you sharing your good fortune with any of your friends? Friends? You can. I dumped all my friends. Ginger don't approve of them. And they had it coming to them, too. I'll tell you that. Thank you. Come no, I don't need to. It's all right. For no. the kids. For the kids. I don't have any kids. You have no kids? Hey, get yourself some kids. Come on. We're I'm sorry. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You that didn't change. Uh, I still got the same bookmaker. I still treat my family the same way. I don't talk to them. I got the same barber. Only now he travels with me. <laughs> Mr. Johnson, there's been a mistake, sir. You're not the winner. Your balls were in the wrong order. <laughs> well, what does this mean? It means you'll have to give back all the money. You're not the winner? You phony. <laughs> Come on, boys. Let's go find the real winner. <laughs> I'm not the winner. I lost my wife, my kids, my friends. I'll tell you the truth. I had it coming to me. 